algorithm efficiency. Before coming into algorithm efficiency, let's see what's an algorithm. An algorithm is a mathematical process to solve a problem which has finite number of steps. In simple terms, we can say an algorithm is set of instructions to solve a given problem. So what we mean by algorithm efficiency? Algorithm efficiency shows how efficiently an algorithm solves a problem. This is a matter of computational resources. An algorithm is said to be efficient if it uses minimum amount of resources such as memory and CPU. To measure efficiency of an algorithm, we consider two things, time complexity and space complexity. Time complexity means how much time it will take. Space complexity means how much extra space it will require. When we talk about efficiency of an algorithm, we see these three things, best case, worst case, and average case efficiency. When it's best case, your algorithm will behave good and time efficient and it will consume less memory and CPU. When it's worst case, your algorithm behavior is not good, not time efficient and consumes lot of memory and CPU. When it's average case, it behave average. For an example, when it's average case, your algorithm will consume average amount of time and it will consume average amount of memory and CPU. But how this happens? This depends on the data you are going to input into your algorithm. For an example, consider this array. It is a sorted array. Assume you want to find number 5. So when you look at this array, number 5 is in first location. Therefore, it will find number 5 in no time, means you have the best case. Look at this example. Now the data are same, but it is in descending order. In this case, if you want to find number 5, you have to iterate through the array until you find the last element. Therefore, in this case, you have the worst number of iterations. And look at the last example. Here you see number 5 in the middle, that means as the second element. So it is between the best case and worst case. Now you see that the computational resources will be consumed according to the input you are going to use within your algorithm. How do we describe resource consumption? We describe resource consumption using Big O notation. Big O is a standard mathematical notation that shows how efficient an algorithm is in the worst case scenario. If you want to calculate the complexity of an algorithm, list down all the basic operations in the code and count the number of times each get executed and add all the counts to get an equation in terms of n. So accordingly, you will get this kind of complexity functions O1, On, On squared and more. We know that there are a number of searching and sorting algorithms. If we consider these algorithms, different algorithms have different complexity functions. So now on, if you want to care about your computational resources, you can try to write algorithms which can perform better than before.